Hello everyone, welcome to Anvi Hearing. Today I'm going to tell you some tips for conversations with loved ones with hearing loss. Hearing loss is a common condition and it often affects our parents or loved ones as they age. When communicating with someone who has hearing loss, making some adjustments to your approach can greatly enhance the quality of your interactions. In this audio, we will explore essential tips for effective communication, ensuring that your conversations remain meaningful and enjoyable for both you and your loved ones. Before diving into communication strategies, it's essential to grasp the challenges faced by individuals with hearing loss. Hearing loss can vary in degree and configuration, but it generally makes it more difficult for affected individuals to perceive certain sounds, especially high-pitched tones and softer speech. Here are some pointers to aid in improving communication. Gain their attention. Before you start speaking, ensure you have their full attention. Approaching them from the front, making eye contact or gently touching their arm can signal your intention to communicate. This step is crucial as it prepares them to focus on your message. Face-to-face communication Position yourself directly in front of your loved one to allow them to see your face clearly. Good lighting is essential to ensure your facial expressions, lip movements and gestures are visible. These visual cues can significantly aid in understanding. Clear and moderate speech. Speak clearly and at a moderate pace. There's no need to shout or exaggerate your speech as it can distort sound. Enunciate your words and avoid mumbling. Aim for a natural and clear tone. Incorporate gestures and facial expressions. Use gestures, facial expressions and body language to complement your verbal communication. These visual cues can provide additional context and help convey your message effectively. A nod, smile or pointing can go a long way. Reduce background noise. Minimize background noise as much as possible during your conversation. Background sounds like the TV or radio can create distractions and make it challenging for individuals with hearing loss to focus on your voice. Move to a quieter area or lower the volume of competing sounds. Rephrase instead of repeating. If your loved one doesn't understand something, try rephrasing your statement instead of repeating. Using different words or providing additional context can increase their chances of comprehension. Visual aids and written communication. Consider using visual aids, written notes, text messages or captions to supplement verbal communication. Visual cues and written information can re enforce important points and provide clarity when needed. Practice patience and empathy. Effective communication may require more time and effort, so practice patience and empathy. Be understanding and supportive and allow your loved ones the time to process and respond to the conversation. Encourage active participation. Encourage your loved one to actively participate in the conversation. Let them know know it's okay to ask for clarification or request that you repeat something. Active participation can help them feel more engaged and involved in the interaction. Effective communication with loved ones who have hearing loss is not only possible but also essential for maintaining strong relationships. By understanding the challenges they face and implementing these communication tips, you can ensure Ensure that your conversation remains enjoyable and meaningful. Remember, 
your patience understanding and support go a long way in creating positive communication experiences encourage your loved ones to seek professional help from an audiologist to address their hearing loss as early intervention and management can make a significant difference in their quality of life for more information visit our website which is www.anvhearing.com or call us at 96 5839 5839